was tagged a lot in this viral video, so let's talk about it. This video, and I'm not going to play it because he has since removed it, and out of respect, I'm not going to continue to have it circulate online. But if you didn't see it, it is him responding to a grown man who left an inappropriate comment regarding his nine-year-old little girl. The first thing I want to say is I commend him for calling out a predator online and the entire TikTok community for going to work to identify the guy in hopes that he crawls back into his hole and someone goes and looks at his hard drive. But here's the thing I struggle with. The original video in which that comment came from was still online, meaning that a father now knows that predators are looking at his daughter that way, yet the video and other videos with said child remain up. And due to the virality of this video, that video spiked too meaning more predatory eyes on the video, more likes, possibly inappropriate comments, possibly downloads, saves, you get the point. I personally find it interesting that the first instinct of a parent wasn't to remove the video, like predators are looking at my child this way, R remove content of my child, I don't want those eyes on her. Before people come and say, well, we can't control all the predatory eyes, you're right. We can't, but when it comes to the content parents post online, we can. Those videos and images and videos and information of our children do not need to be posted publicly. That is within our control as parents. Social media is a predator's playground and each and every day it becomes more clear that our children really shouldn't be here.